Wait. Bro's reversing and recording. You like that, dude. I'll tell you. And he's in this line. You know I'm a robot, right? I follow you on TikTok. <laughs> <laughs> no way, dog. Thanks, bro. What's up, Snapchat? Uh, <laughs> so today, um, like I said last night, we're getting some work done on the E28, the E30. I'm going to be going over to an exhaust shop in Santa Ana to uh, see if they can do the exhaust for my E28. My headers, like, they they line up perfectly to the car, but when, uh, when they dump out the bottom, there isn't enough room to attach the collectors on basically both of the pipes that come off of the three cylinders. And yeah, it's just kind of annoying. I'm, I'm, I'm really, I'm really bothered by it. I'm gonna start working again on the bags for the E30 as well as the M-Tech kit for the E30. Cause that's something that needs to happen. And then it's gonna get wrapped. So uh, I'm just gonna get to work. You guys are gonna watch, follow along and uh, hopefully you like it. See ya. It is hot and I am dying out here. Uh, the first exhaust shop that I wanted to try didn't end up working out, um, but I'm out here in Santa Ana. I'm determined. I'm gonna find a shop that can help me out. I'm going to another that's right up the street, and uh, we're gonna see how the rest of this goes. All right, and a little bit of a sad reveal. We're right back at home, and whoa, it's dark. Come on, focus. There we go. Or not focus. Don't know what that word would be. Adjust. Whatever. We're back at home. Unfortunately, the exhaust shop actually couldn't fit the muffler in the space in the in the in the exhaust tunnel that the E28 has. So I'm kind of bothered by that one. And now I'm gonna go do some kind of investigating on how exactly that should fit. All right, I'm gonna get this thing up on some stands. So essentially, I don't have that much room for this dang muffler and there have these exhaust mount kind of brackets that sit right there that I've seen people use. I'm thinking I can maybe throw this guy like right there. Think about and get those hangers going. Oh but I honestly don't know because this thing is like this thing's really fat. Might try to oh, do a little one of these. Get that guy my oh god, that little valve just does not make this easy. What about valve on the bottom? Valve on the bottom. Hung like that. Woo! That might be it. That might be it. Oh, then I'm just gonna bottom out and fucking destroy that valve. Alright, tuck the valve. Oh, I'll tuck the valve hits the drivetrain. Um shoot man, I don't know. Myco, Myco valve exposed. Exposed valve. Valvetronic, baby. All right, so uh, I'm still checking this out, as you can see, and I think that's gonna be my spot. That might be it. Right under there before the, uh, before the rear subframe, because if I try to get in that back spot, it's just not working. I wish, I really wish I filmed it earlier today. I had it all up there and I didn't even take any pictures, so. Mistake, but um, as I'm letting that one sit, I think I'm gonna throw some air suspension pieces on the uh, E30, cause why not? Um, after I do some more testings, but we're testing, so we'll see how this goes. I'm also spending some time organizing my tools, so it's probably not gonna be done, but uh, I promise I'm doing it. Bro, I just got fucking pulled up on, bro. The ops are here. I think I'm screwed. Holy shit. The fucking ops pulled up, man. <laughs> Any John and his fucking murder yeah, mobile. I'm still waiting for the <laughs> other ones. They're in LA right now. Okay. We've just Camera been around. Yeah, we've just been messing around. So after the ops pulled up on me, I fixed <laughs> I fixed like four things in his car real quick. This little dude right here, that part that he showed me wasn't grabbing. So we screwed that in real quick and now he's mint. But I think this is gonna sit right in there like that. If you guys approve, if not, too bad, because I'm doing it tomorrow. Um, Oh shit, well then I got that vacuum line to route. Oh balls. I might have to ask for the muffler to be like removable or something. <laughs> Cause I got this stud, I gotta attach a vacuum line too. Oh hey man. <laughs> Do you followers are better? Fun. Yeah bro, fuck it. Well no, there's not really much to see right <laughs> Hey dog, check this thing out. Golf chronic baby. It's just gonna go punk. I'll make it work. I'll make it work. <laughs> Whipped out the Valvetronic box of goodies. Got the GTR tips out here, bro. That's my just single blast pipe out the rear. Wonk. God, that's the dumbest thing I've ever seen. 
Yeah, I got this little thing. It's like a little vacuum controller box that I guess to use the remote. Hit the button and it'll give a little sucky on this. <laughs> Ayo. Just got this little thing fake wired up into my cigarette lighter, which I don't think I'm gonna leave as the actual power for this box once I get this thing all plugged in. Cause uh, I don't like having stuff plugged into my cigarette lighter. But I got this remote right here. I just wanna see if this thing works. All right, at least this thing looks pretty on camera, bro, fuck. Tomorrow morning, I'm gonna take this thing to the exhaust shop. That's about it. <laughs> That's all I got going on. Is Jaden calling me? I swear to God, he is. Look at this guy. All right, let's see what Jaden got to say. What up, Yado? Yo, you guys still at your house? Yeah, we're still at my house. All right, I'm gonna head over. You're, okay, I'll see you soon. E28 is going to be done soon, hopefully tomorrow, if that muffler gets put in. And then I have to just wire all those electronics that I was talking about. And I'm not going to use the cigarette lighter because I think that's stupid. For this guy, I need to throw all the suspension in. And I also just today ordered myself the AirTech 2, stage 2 management, because uh, I want a little controller. I want to have something digital that controls this thing going up and down. Because I really, really think that this looks tacky. Just like I said yesterday. John, tell me if this looks tacky. That's your air controller. That's what makes your car go. <sighs> Flip it upside, it's upside down. I know, I know. I'm just trying to see if it fits the car. Just like I said before, it is exhaust day. That's a bad intro. I'm doing this again. What's up, Reddit? Um, it's the next day, and uh, I'm about to take the E28 to the exhaust shop and see if we can get this muffler on part two. Let's hope this car makes it. <laughs> I'm so tired of this noise. Ah! So I just dropped off the car uh, at seven days, and I think they're gonna be able to do it in about two hours. So I'm uh, I'm pretty stoked for that. I'm calling Holden to see if he can give me a ride, but I don't think he's picking up. He's probably a little asleep considering it's like 9:30 in the morning. But uh, 9:49, sorry. But I'm gonna take a little walk. I see a Pizza Hut, maybe a Starbucks or something. My boy with it. <laughs> What's good? Thanks so much, dude. All right. Just waited about two hours. Aiden dropped me at home, and um, I need to get my exhaust back. So we're gonna do that now. Oh yeah, vlog squad. And uh, we're whipping in this fucking Volvo. Bro, it's this a, thing it's... goes absolutely mental. Do not, do not hate on the five cylinder, bro. Don't hate on the five cylinder. <laughs> five cylinder turn them dogs, bro. bro I got hella <laughs> traction, bro. There. Oh, no. I've had to fill up the, the coolant. The amount of times a week that it it's like check engine coolant too. level low. Oh, wow. Stop safely immediately. Just pull over <laughs> immediately. and turn on the car. It's gonna blow the fuck. No, it says ASAP. It actually it says doesn't it. actually. No, it does. it does. When it does it again, I'll show you a picture of it. It says it says please stop and turn off car ASAP. <laughs> All right. no, it it's okay, the, the Aiden's uh, Audi that I was in had just as many lights, bro. That thing is on its light. That, that oh, thing is oh. just as bad. Yeah, that's sweet. Thank you so much. Uh, that's nice. Bro, this is fucking nice. This is really amazing. I'm like actually impressed with, with how this sounds and how it's driving. I haven't tried to get it to the red line yet to see if it's performing better, but I have my O2 back on, and uh, I'm really excited right now. Uh, I'll update more when I'm not driving. Other than some of the noise still being like a little much, like, yeah, I'll just get a start up from inside of the cabin. I know you got one before, but I felt like it was a little, uh, still a little noisy, but here we go. Yeah, dude. It's just like a low rumble. It's really, really nice. I just put $40 in. What's up with that? Huh. Oh, and we're running like a little bit warm but it's a really, really hot day. So I'm hoping that accounts for some of it. I don't know though. We're about to go stop by and see my homie Jaden and uh, get our first person other than Tim's reaction. First homie on the street to see us roll up. Valve's closed, my guy. That's fucking crazy. It looks a little it's funny, smelly. but it kind of looks cool. It looks unique. And I like Very that. Very unique. It stinks though. It stinks though. Very stinky. I think it still runs rich. But oh my god. At least I can drive without wanting to die though. I know, I'm still. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll catch in again when I'm home, but uh, this is tight. 
might consider adding a resonator. All right, we are gonna go for a little bit of a sunset cruise right now. Since I got a new exhaust and uh, I'm really hyped about the way it sounds, we're gonna do a little bit of a test drive to see if I'm, uh, I guess, okay if this being what closed valve sounds like. Cause it's Dude, I made it to the sunset and these two weird fucking cars showed up. Okay, we just popped <laughs> Guys, I grilled this fucking cockroach. It's fully a cockroach. What if it were alive still? It's definitely not. Poor guy. It's definitely fucking dead. I think dead. it survived like radiation and shit. Oh my god. I, I died. Can't survive, no, my hood's really. They can't like, survive Sam's. Your phone's gonna animal. melt. Ugh. Guys, I burned this cockroach. <laughs> I burned it. It's been burned. It's kind of bad, man. My question is, is so how long have you had that in there? I don't know. That's a good question. I probably I knew. It doesn't look that. That hard. looks crispy. Really? Crispy. I feel like they all look like that. All crispy fuckers. Now. Oh. Say what's up. What's up? <laughs> <laughs> Everyone send some love to Holden real quick. I blew up my car. The Miata blew up. And uh. Yeah, yeah. Remember that ad that we posted like two videos ago? <laughs> the price has now gotten lowered. Um, I want at least 25. Okay, I will try to give you 25 and then I'll make it a KBD drift car. I don't really know what I'm doing today. I was going to get some work done on the E30 and possibly go buy a part for the E28. Um, but the homie Josh is going to come pick me up and we're going to go on an adventure. So, I don't know what the adventure is, but... Look at this guy! The fuck? The fuck? part two. First he showed up in the fucking blue ass thing. And now homie's got this shit going on. Looks like a fucking lightning bolt. Look at this motherfucker. Dude, I, I woke up today and I was like, alright, I'm gonna do some work on my car, you know, get my shit done, and now we're doing this fucking shit again. Tight beat. Yeah, I'm not really complaining though. Right in the race car today. Yeah, we like that. <laughs> Dude, this dude loving it. Can he see me at all? Nope. Dude, that's fire. You like that? That's how it's yeah. supposed to be. He likes that. He's not even looking now. Now he's all, oh shit. Dang. He watched that thing. Dang. Yeah. <laughs> dude, this is cool. Because this is just like my hood. And then we're in the fucking Bazinga Mobile. Bazinga <laughs> <laughs> Mobile. It's kind of cool. Do you cool. know what gas is called in Italy? What's that? B Benzina or something. Benzina? That's what the thing says. Yeah, on the, on the yeah, back, yeah, that's yeah, sick. Yeah. No, on the uh, Huracan. Oh, really? I was like, what the heck? Is ben does that say Benzinga when I first got in there? <laughs> tight task. Bro, he liked that. <laughs> he's, he's, in, he's in the he, ice cream. He, he liked that. He enjoyed that. that. Look at this car. He was just whipped. Bro's reversing and recording. You like that, dude. I'll dude. tell you. And he's in this line. You know I'm a robot, right? Bro, that was Type in the head. <laughs> you know, I'm, I'm freaking sweet at this, dude. I'm telling you. Because you got to be ready to go. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Yeah, you can park wherever you want. out of here. Yep, exactly. I'll be like that. Race car. Super car. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Well, you got to get the women in there, dude. Oh, yeah. See, first, that's what I'm telling him, bro. I get two girls in there at a time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yep. Yeah, multiple girls. Uh, multiple girls in there. You know, a two-seater, I fit two. Now, I'm trying to go for three girls. <laughs> I know. Only, only yeah, two get, seats, uh, Get the foursome going. Get the, yeah, there we go. Yeah, we need that. Get three of them in there, get the foursome. He, he oh. like, he like. <laughs> well, this thing's gorgeous. This has got the 4.5 liter demand uh, motorsports engine in it. So wow. It's got about 550 horsepower. Damn. Dang. Little smoke. And it weighs nothing. Oh, I believe it. Oh. <laughs> Have a good one. Damn, bro. Like, nice flex, bro. Bro just flex real yeah. hard. Brought him to the location. I was on top of the world. Bro has one of the cleanest C5s that I've seen in like a minute. These guys were just chilling here. Yeah, that, is that thing's nice. Damn, this thing kind of wild though. Shit, bro, what the fuck? <laughs> Back in the whip ski. Bro had a little present in here, man. <laughs> oh my god, coupons? One serious makeout session. You bro, like might, that? Might have to keep that one yeah, for myself. You got, you got Cruising the PCH again, and we spot the whip ski. That is pretty, man. That blue is nice. That is a blue right there. Dude, they're whipping the goofy trike. <laughs> oh, look at the dog! Michigan plate part two, not two Jay-Z. Uh, that shit funny. You guys both got goofy plates. You like that. This guy's plate says safety car. <laughs> Shit's kind of funny. Make it back in my house. I might try to get some stuff done on my cars, but like, I honestly doubt it. It's so hot out that like yeah. I've just kind of been showing recently. Josh about to edit a video today. Yeah. This guy edit, about to be grinding. Edit, upload same day. Yeah, bro. Watch. You know how this guy does it. 
watch. What time is it? It's 1.30. This guy about had a video up in two hours. Yeah, two Easy hours, watch, you'll see. You'll be like, this is a banger, too. <laughs> Alright guys, today I'm a... Uh, what is up, guys? What's up, Snapchat? Welcome back. <laughs> this is the start of today's vlog, dude. So, they basically... Basically, I asked for my muffler to be, like, removable, and they added this little clamp to where my muffler would kind of go over the pipe and clamp down so that I could just loosen it and take the muffler off. They put the clamp on, they charged me a little extra to put the clamp on, and then they just welded it on both sides. So it's just like, there's no point of the clamp being there. So Vizu just set off this guy's car alarm. And, uh, oh my god. Oh shit. Oh, oh he's getting active. It was so hot when we were out there. Anyway. It feels so much better yeah. now. Now we got the breeze going. <laughs> Everybody go shop grow. Cop a cool E30 t-shirt. These things are awesome. Support the homie. It's not my brand. Now for some shots. Yeah, I guess we're just gonna like... Ha, <laughs> thanks dude! Dude, we're getting, we're getting hype everywhere, man. All right, we made it back from uh, our little adventure to Wedge. I dropped off John, or actually, sorry, John went home, and uh, I'm back here with my car. I was able to get my muffler removed after all that drama with uh, everything that wasn't really working out, with the exhaust shop that wasn't working. I took the muffler off. As you can see, there is actually a little tack weld that was on there. So that's why this clamp wasn't coming off and why I had so many issues with it. But I got the muffler removed just because I need it removed to be able to wire everything for the Valvetronic. So that will be finished tomorrow, but for now, I'm gonna pack this all up. I might go for another drive with the straight pipe just because I think it'd be funny. <laughs> um, but my camera's about to die. And uh, I think we got enough done for today, which wasn't that much, but uh, it's okay because we're gonna get work done tomorrow. It's just been so damn hot out that uh, it's been hard to keep up. <laughs> well, you gotta get the women in there, dude. Oh, oh no, not the 528, man. 